this is something I think we do need to talk about. All right, guys, I think uh, you're. Let's let's uh, <laughs> let's just start to. Welcome to the Bad Posture Podcast. My name's Matt. And I'm Anthony. And we're gonna figure out what the fuck we're doing here on YouTube. <laughs> 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 but uh yeah so so before we hit record uh we were just talking about uh we need to n- find uh our lane we're trying to find our lane right now we're trying not to copy other people's lanes we're trying to set ourselves apart so and i mean honestly the, the fallout the fallout crew <laughs> let me fix you uh this is like a a quick thing hold on what the fuck happened to you? What? Ooh, that picture looks so much better. I know, bro, because I'm a god, bro. But um, now yeah, I, yeah, okay. Now I keep looking at myself. Yeah, I'm sorry, bro. I'm so fucking sexy. Yeah. <laughs> but um, <laughs> but um, <laughs> but yeah. All right. So um, yeah. So I'm thinking about uh even though i don't like um fallout much anymore um i feel like i need to good game like it's it's just i feel like i need to make more fallout content i just wasn't enjoying making the content it wasn't as much as hating the game it's not as much that i hate the game as much as i wasn't enjoying making the content he hates the player yeah, I hate the player. I hate the player, which is myself, not the game. And I've been in a yeah, slump so... slash sick for a past week or so. You know what I mean? I've been thinking, doing some thinking about it. And yeah, I'm like kind of at the point where I want to start making Fallout content again because uh, it did well and a lot of people enjoyed it. You know what I mean? But go ahead. What are your thoughts? I keep cutting you off as soon as you're about to say something. Yeah, I mean. So yeah, but it's just like one of those things that. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. Go ahead. No, I don't. I don't think. I don't think we should pressure you to do that. I mean, if everybody leaves the YouTube channel, then so be it. Because you're not doing Fallout content. True. They facts. Facts. They facts. weren't there for. They weren't there for you in the beginning. Facts. So. Facts. No, I, I agree with that. I do. I. I I kind of feel that way as well, though. Yeah. If you don't like me because I'm not doing the content you want me to do, I guess. Uh, I think that's probably my biggest problem, man. I, I try to do what I feel that people would like me to do. You know what I mean? Like, okay, yeah. people will like this. Let me do this. You know what I'm saying? Right. Um, I feel like that's part of uh, part of my problem. Yeah. I mean... It's the it's the dirty know. world of YouTube, man. That's yeah. that's legit. Like I, I'm sure I'm sure I'm not the only person that feels that way on YouTube. You know right. what I mean? Like I'm right. sure there's bigger people that feel the same way that they're stuck doing right. something they don't want to be doing, but they know it pays bills. So they um not that I'm paying bills with my YouTube money by any means. Right. But, uh, <laughs> oh, you're frozen. What the fuck happened? I know. No, that's weird. Doesn't usually happen like that. Yeah, I don't even. I can't even like <laughs> just uh back out and come back in. It should be fine. No, it's my it's my camera thing. Oh, it's you okay? Oh shit! Dun, 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 dun. Good. Look at this bad posture. Yeah, man. Welcome. It's fine, bro. Lean the camera. It makes your posture look worse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't. I really just don't think you should be pressured into, you know, making content just for the dollars. Yeah. No, I think it's the worst. I think that's the worst thing to do. To be honest with you. Yeah. I think if you just focus on the money side of things, um, it comes out in your content. Like right. people know, people can tell. That's right. kind of why I stopped streaming because I just didn't have it in me anymore. Like I just didn't 
enjoy doing it like when I started. You know what I mean? So I, I kind of quit and, uh, yeah, randomly pop up. Randomly. You know what I mean? But, um, yeah, man, I just, I don't know, man. I think I'm just in like a weird space, dude. Like, uh, yeah. Like a weird Yeah, you place still got your my... fucking Christmas tree up. Yeah, you are in a weird space. Yeah, it's called, that's called <laughs> depression at its finest. When you still, if you still have your Christmas tree up, you should probably talk to a therapist. <laughs> I think my sister still got her Christmas lights up. Fuck I'm yeah, saying. man. Christmas lights are fire, bro. She said she said it's okay because the neighbor got them up too. Yeah. She's like, but but uh there's change colors with the holidays. So word. Yeah, <laughs> mine's just more of a placeholder because like if I get rid of that, then there's just nothing there. Yeah. Um, Isn't that where you're putting the fucking Yeah, but I'm not getting that until like April. Oh shit. So it's like it's gonna be there for a while, man, because it's just a placeholder at this point. Yeah. It's something interesting in the background. So you don't have to look at me. You know what I mean? And I like, I honestly, I do like the lights. I mean, that's part of it. Like, as you can, I mean, I have lights everywhere in the room. Like I, that's part of it. I do like having lights. Yeah. Colored I do lights like lights in my room. Yeah. I, I was in, I was in this room all night. To be honest, the only time I turn <laughs> this one on up here is, uh, staring at those lights. Hell yeah, man. But yeah, the only reason I turn this one up here on is, uh, for this, like, I don't sit in my room with this on. It's just so it's just so I'm not like it's not super dark in the background. Just turn that on. But yeah, I never sit with that light on. Like when I'm in this room, it's legitimately like all the other. You know, lights. What you could put there, bro, a guitar. I have a I do have a snowboard on the on that side too behind that tree. There is a snowboard there. Yeah, but it's not lit. So then it, the reason I like a you light. Are, back yeah, there, you're you're just in a weird space, bro. I just like a light there, bro. <laughs> you know what I mean. I just want I just want a light there because then it balances the two lights. Yeah. Where if there's not a light there, then it's just dark over there. And it's weird. Okay. To me. To me. I just don't <laughs> like it, bro. I just like balance. I just want balance in my life, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. But uh yeah, man. I don't know, man. I've just been in a kind of strange space lately. I've been working yeah. more. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't know. I just kind of, yeah, I don't know, man. I just, uh, I don't really know what it is to be honest with you. I don't know why I'm bummed out recently. I mean, I've also kind of felt like shit, but I don't know if that, I don't know if I kind of felt like shit because I'm kind of bummed out. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Okay. Like, I don't, I don't, you know what I mean? Like, you know, like sometimes you get sick when you're kind of like worn (laughs) down and shit. Yeah. Like, I don't know if that's why I like was feeling like hell. You need a good trip. I do. Yeah. I do need to, to be honest. I would, I would love to, but I'll get it when it comes around. You know what I mean? Right. If it yeah. shows up, it shows up. I, I don't, I don't normally seek it out. I actually learned how they make, make it, make the gels. Oh yeah. And it was really interesting. Uh, I mean, of course, people can get three D molds, like three D okay. printed molds. Okay. And they're like the little pyramids and shit, but. They call it window pane. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So they'll take diffusers from uh, fluorescent lights. You know, the pane. The, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. They'll cut that and then they'll use that as a mold. Oh, that's crazy. That makes yeah, sense though because that's what it looks like. Like now right. that you say that, it kind of looks like that. Right. Yeah, yeah that's wild. my mind. I was like, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's uh, that's cool though. That's actually like a cool f- little weird fact, a oh. weird factoid. What other weird facts did I fucking did? I was just tripping yesterday. Yeah, how how did your trip go? Gathering you walk, weird facts. Did you walk us through your trip? I mean, set the scene, bro. I had gotten out of the shower. Okay. And I was like, I want to do drugs. Hell yeah. <laughs> So I took this tab of acid and it was just one tab. You did one. So it wasn't word. like, yeah, word. but it was, word. it was pretty strong. Word, word. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I don't know. I listened to music for a while. Just, just jamming. actively listening to music. Cause that's what I fucking do. Yeah. Like, like really just, listening. Not like me listening to music where it's just like noise. Right. Like I'm, I'm listening to where like drums 
are placed and right, you know, right. chord progressions in certain genres right. and you're shit. looking at like the structure of the music more than just like oh this is just something cool to listen to like that's how i listen to music like oh this is cool i like this right. song you know what i mean like i don't ever like analyze any of it you know what i mean right yeah i love to know how they did certain things like it there's yeah, there's dope. producers out there that just blow my fucking mind yeah like, yeah yeah man there's, but, uh, there's some people are just talented as fuck dude then yeah i just uh watched that what was that night shit called yeah what is it called again uh <sighs> fuck dude i don't know it's on netflix guys it's a uh, type in like night nature or something you could probably find it but it's like a it's like a nature show um at night all at night super high def cameras yeah, yeah they got like dope ass cameras that take like yeah. the smallest amount of light literally like just moonlight made it look like daylight on these cameras like it was fucking insane but yeah, it was pretty it's cool because cool. uh i <laughs> it's weird that i love the technology around me when i'm tripping yeah like, i love like neon lights and just color like just lights yeah like you were saying you know Do you like using technology though when you trip yeah see i don't see that that's where yeah. i'm different like i, mean, I like i like cool I things like using around my me. software because yeah, it's it's just another extension of me like i'm, I'm already it's already like yeah, you're a comfortable muscle with memory right, right right you know what i mean i don't have to think right um, yeah i get that i like but even like my phone like i hate my phone when i'm tripping dude yeah i can't use my phone i can't read i can't read i can't do anything that's right in front of me right 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 like i can't grab the blunt you know what i mean right once it i don't gets think to I've, I've never length. smoked weed when i was tripping yeah never have eh. It's not good for everybody. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, I would. I'd probably do it at, like the end of a trip. Yeah. Like, cause then one or two things are gonna happen. It's gonna make me tired, possibly, or it's gonna like amplify the trip and like kind of bring me back up, which is I'm cool with that too. You know what I mean? Right. So either way, it'll be like a positive at the end. I don't think when you're peaking is the time to smoke. Right. For me, at least. But it was just cool being surrounded by all that. You know colorful technology and shit fuck yeah and then watching nature on tv fuck yeah <laughs> i feel the same like, way though. i love nature so much but from my living room <laughs> well yeah i mean yeah, you'd be out of your mind to actually try to go out there and like even oh, when we God. tripped the one time at the casino like and we were like when we just walked down by the river at like nighttime and that was weird it was cool but it was cold and at the same I mean, time I, and it was kind of strange right i could definitely see what Myself was weird down the there woods. was that they have that art exhibit along the uh, oh, along God. the river, right? Yeah, and they have that. Uh, it's like a architectural structure, and they have music playing. Do you remember that? Oh no no no! You talking about the uh, the uh, uh, oh maybe I'm maybe I'm thinking of something different. I was I was thinking of the um the bridge, the lights on the bridge that's like powered by the wind. Oh yeah, that was that was yeah. We saw that shit too, but no, they had they had like a architectural structure that like they have some music playing inside. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I do remember. And yeah, it's going. amplifying it in both directions. Yeah, it's fucking ridiculous. Yeah, it's hella weird. Another. <laughs> remember the grass though? The grass looked weird. Yeah, every everything looks. Oh, weird. Yeah, everything looks weird. like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> everything looks fucking weird. But yeah, I mean, the people in the casino look strange as well. Um, my cousin wasn't feeling it though. I don't. I don't remember him taking as much as us though. I feel like we yeah. took more than he took. I think he took one and we took two. Yeah, maybe. And I feel like that's always the biggest mistake. Not, right. to, but it's also a mistake to pressure someone into taking more than they want to take. Right. That's also a mistake. But it's almost like I kind of prefer people to do the same amount as me. So you're all on the same level. Yeah, yeah, because then it's like yeah, then you don't feel like awkward and weird. Like, uh, like I'm tripping way too fucking hard right now, and the other person's like, "Oh, I'm tripping too." But I'm right. like, I'm like, legitimately, grass is talking to me right now. It's forming <laughs> words, <laughs> and they're like, "What? You're weird." It's like, fuck, you didn't take enough. <laughs> but yeah, yeah that's I love a, tripping, man. I think I'll trip for the rest of my life. Oh, 100 percent. I wouldn't like the trip consistently for the rest of my life. Like I wouldn't no, like no, not no. like like could you imagine that, dude? How fucked that would be. No. We've talked about you know, that though, before. I about, did like, watch tripping I did watch sober. some I watched Elon Musk, right? And he made so much 
more sense. <laughs> and it sound and bro, and it sounded like he was talking so smoothly. Yeah. Like you know he doesn't. He he talks really weird. It sounded like it's he strange. was talking normal. Yeah. Yeah. He was like That's interesting. I know, man. I my mind was blown. He's a cyborg. <laughs> or an alien. One of the two. An alien cyborg, maybe. Both of the two. Yeah. Could be it. Yeah, man, it's a uh, strange. Definitely man. a weird guy. Yeah, he is. He's strange, but I feel like he's kind of normal though. At the same time, man. Right. Like I feel like there's yeah, some. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's just like a. He's just like me and you. Yeah, I think o- uh, only, only he's a lot smarter. A lot smarter and richer. <laughs> <laughs> he's exactly like us. Human ex- being. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was gonna say he's exactly. I was just everything that's different. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like this, except I'm not plastic and I don't have water. I mean, I do have water in me. <laughs> Are we like 70% water or something? Uh, I don't know, man. We're we're not watermelons. I got a lemon in mine. I have a cap on mine. I have a deer on mine. Drink that shit. Maybe we should, uh, I don't know. I was going to say maybe yeah. start going live on different platforms, but. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I just so where I'm at is like I just feel like we need to find a new lane of content. I guess I do like the podcast idea. Like I do like doing yeah. conversations, talking, being us. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like I I do like that, but I feel like everybody does that. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So like I kind of just not like funny, so we're not famous. You don't have to be funny. You just have to like, we weren't famous <laughs> prior. You know what I mean? Like yeah. we're no different than like a regular H3 or whatever. You know what I mean? Like we're no different <laughs> other than that. Right. <laughs> you got to look like them, but um, <laughs> yeah, you just need like weird shirts and shit. But, uh, but yeah, fucking, I, I don't feel like we're, we're not much different than them. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right. Like we right. we could do exactly what they did. Yeah. Or cancel do. people? Should we just cancel people? We could because I'm sure people. that's what they're doing. <laughs> yeah, they're just hyping it up. I don't know. I think people are already canceling people, and they're just adding to the fuel of the canceling. Yeah, but they've kind of been known for like canceling, like calling people, people. out and fucking yeah, yeah. like just uh, campaigning it. Those those uh, the prank videos. I watched the whole thing on how uh, on the death of prank. The prank video genre, yeah, yeah. So what was interesting? People started faking pranks. They they had to keep one upping each other, right? And then they start faking them, and then H three starts calling them out. Then they start doing even crazier fake pranks to get on H three, right? And he turns into one of those things. It's kind of like ridiculousness. Like people essentially, or jackass, or any of those types of like stunt shows where people are like oh look i can do crazy that's why they have to have those disclaimers at the beginning i'm like don't send us things like you know what i mean right because people will just do the craziest things they can just to fucking we're not gonna watch them (laughs) yeah well it was interesting i i sent you that uh rob deerdick i I sent you like a clip from that rob deerdick interview with steve and uh but he was talking about how they the clip but did you watch the episode or i started watching the episode yeah yeah well he gets he gets into um how uh (laughs) <laughs> yeah well he got hypnotized but yeah but no he he starts getting into um how he how they get their clips so they yeah. ha- essentially have like a team of people that basically just go through the whole fucking internet just looking for funny shit and then they just track down whoever whoever's video it was and they like email them they right. like go through like con like send them contracts Licensing. and shit right they basically yeah. they basically license their videos which is kind of interesting it's kind of interesting like when he describe the business side like you can make so much money because you can essentially buy the rights to the video and you don't pay them any they're not paying them royalties for those videos right right so like they're posting them on fucking facebook they're doing you know what i mean like and just monetizing it because they have a large enough following that they're able to monetize and they're literally not making any content they're just finding content and monetizing it and making money it's kind of (laughs) scumbaggy to be honest um i I mean If you're smart <laughs> enough to put, hey, contact this email for licensing, 
it should be well, no, it's not even that price it's, your stuff but it's not even that they, they like say he said sometimes they have to like dig in to like figure out who the fuck's video it is you know right I mean? and like, those people are probably the cheapest oh 100 you know I mean? they're probably free the people the people who are like contact for licensing Look, i'm sure are, i'm sure they don't pay anybody what do you mean i'm sure they're not paying anyone for those videos they give them a licensing fee i bet they don't People are just happy. Mm-hmm. Most of them are just people. They're probably just like, oh, just regular average Joes. They don't know anything about licensing. And they're probably man, like, oh, know. that's cool. I'm telling you, bro, you're giving people too much credit, man, thinking that they're I smart know, enough man. to get a fee, I... man. It's, it, they're not, man. A lot of people aren't, man. This, sadly. And uh, yeah, so then they. Uh, Damn. The world they give, of licensing is insane. Yeah. They give permission to use the video <clears throat> and uh, they sign a little contract saying that you're allowed to use the video for your platforms. And it's probably a crazy contract that no one can understand anyway. Yeah. And uh, yeah, then they get the fucking videos and they can do whatever they want and make all the money they want off of it. And no one can do anything about you see, it. Uh, you see there's a new Nipsey Hussle song? No. And it was an old Tito Lopez verse. And it was licensed. It was like relicensed. Okay. Or some shit. Yeah. The, uh, that was just pretty crazy. It's not like a brand new verse. Uh, so, no. uh, right right you know that's what they do though like it was like an old do. old song <laughs> yeah so they do i mean look at a uh, look at tupac for example man they're just like dropping his you know what i mean whoever owns the rights to his music they're just dropping i mean they haven't done it in a long time but like whenever after he like after he was dead they were dropping tons of fucking tupac songs or like they did that whole um uh, i think it wasn't that that might have just been biggie where they did like the biggie duets or whatever yeah. Where like they were just taking Biggie verses and throwing them on different beats with like other oh, yeah, artists, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? I mean Same they did thing. that with Tupac too. Yeah, I, mean, I was gonna say I, I, I can't remember if Tupac yeah. had one too, but yeah, but you know what I mean? Like that's so they do. Man, you got the rights to that fucking verse. You can right. fucking just put it over a different beat, change the timing mm-hmm. a little bit, and boom. Now you put out a new song that a million people are gonna buy because they're dead, and they're like, oh, new music, even though they're dead. You know what I mean? Yeah, I need to. Start Meanwhile, buying, you already have that music. <laughs> I need to start buying licenses to verses. Right. Shit, hold on to him. I swear, yeah, I, I got some dude that I mean, Ian, Ian James. Oh yeah, I hope he hears this. He got fucking mad beats of mine. Yeah, he just sitting on him. He just yeah, he just bought the rights to him. <laughs> 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 That's hilarious, dude. <laughs> it's funny. Hey man, I got a few people like that. My buddy, hey. or Logan, Logan did that too. Word word. Yeah. Shout out to I had a bunch of people like them support me at the beginning. Where's Ian at? I don't know, man. I haven't talked to that fucker in so long. He'd, he'd be interesting to talk to. Yeah, okay. I would love to have him on this, dude. Yeah. He's fucking funny, man. Right. He's a fucking funny. And he's got a <laughs> hell of a story, man. Like, honestly, like, like as a human, like, he has a pretty, uh, pretty interesting. Let's put him on the list. Yeah, we should actually. I didn't, I literally haven't yeah. thought about Ian in like years, dude. I think about him all the time, man. He he really supported me. Yeah, he's a dope dude, was, man. He supported a, a lot of people, man. Good thing. Yeah. He supported a lot of people. Um, but yeah, he's a he's a genuine like fucking solid dude, though. But enough sucking his dick, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it's all you get, Ian, if you're listening. Fuck you. It's all the nice things. So go fuck yourself. Hit me up sometime. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, man, it's uh, yeah, it's just I don't know, man. Everything's fucking just kind of, kind of interesting. There's actually another dude. Do you know um, we could possibly get on uh, uh, what the fuck? He did stuff with tracks. I want to, I want to say his name's. It starts with a D. It's like Danny or. Fuck, I can't remember. Anyway. I kind of. Yeah. He's he's interesting, man. He's uh he went to school for like uh some like shit. It's pretty uh pretty interesting. I met him through Ian actually. I've actually met him through Ian. That's what made me think about him. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Strange guy. Interesting guy. <laughs> yeah. Who else should we get on? Who? Uh, I really just want to interview weird people. Yeah. Like I, mean, I would love we, to just talk to strangers. Look, we got some weird friends. I mean, uh, I brought up interesting. Logan. Well, I think like, we I feel like weird on wrong, here. Yeah, I feel like weird's the wrong word. Um, because I feel like Logan everyone is, is like a weirdo, but we know some interesting. Right. We have some interesting friends. Right. Interesting and talented people. Right, like, right, for real. Yeah, like they have cool stories. That's what I like, man. I right. love. It's kind of like what's the, what was that? Uh, 
I don't know if it was like a, I think it was a blog, um, something New York, um, humans of New York or, you know what I'm talking about? Mm -mm. Nope. They, they would essentially just talk to, um, New Yorkers, um, and random people in New York. Yeah. Just catch them and take a picture of them and write a blog about them. It was pretty cool, man. Okay. I think it was called humans. Of, I think they might even made like a documentary about it. I'm literally have two phones sitting in front of me. I'm like, where's my phone? Doop, 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 doop. Um, doop, 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 doop. of New York. Can't stop playing with this microphone. I just like moving it. Yeah, I I tend to just like rest my arm on it. I'll just like grab it like it's like I'm playing a fucking guitar. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, humans in New York. That's what it is, man. It's uh, it's interesting, dude. They got a whole website, guys. Go check out humans of New York if you haven't heard of it. It's Okay. sometimes they talk to like homeless people sometimes they talk to like business people or just random people they just catch random people out the street and uh right. interview them and it's a it's a pretty cool fucking thing man yeah. i think it's an interesting lane it's been around for a very long time actually i knew about it whenever i was doing uh videography photography things what's that one chick on tiktok she's like a, it's like drunk history but it's like drunk expert and she like talks about things she no she should have no business talking about, but she's drunk. And it uh, kind of nah. sounds. <laughs> That's funny as fuck. She she was explaining how to record a sine wave. Yeah, <laughs> like in depth. <laughs> and she doesn't know. I mean, it, it was there was facts. <laughs> oh, like she actually knew how to like, knew yeah, about it. They were facts. <laughs> that's but were that's they all I got. I don't know. When you say facts, she looked them up. And okay. Like, yeah, that could be it. She could know. just be looking them up, right? Yeah, that's had, funny. Like, somebody tell, tell her, hey, say the script. Right. That's or kind of memorize funny, this script, and then we'll get you drunk. That was a good and show, though. <laughs> drunk history. That was pretty good. Yeah. I actually enjoyed drunk history. I think what's his name tried to do like a similar premise. Uh, Jeff Ross. He tried yeah. to do like a roast history or something like that, and it wasn't that good. Yeah. It was it wasn't good. I think it's on Netflix. So check it out. You tell me if it's good. I don't think it's good. I don't think it's that <laughs> funny. You know what I mean? Like I like roasts. I like making fun of shit. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. But um, it was weird. It, it I don't know. It was just it was clunky. I, I think the thing I like about roasts is when they're live yeah. and like you know what I mean. Like you see real reactions. Like for me to roast fucking abe lincoln like you don't see the reaction like the from them you know what i mean so it just kind of right. sounds off like you know what i mean but uh okay i don't know something about reactions or where it's at yeah man fucking you know so what you have for dinner bro did you eat anything good for dinner taco bell <laughs> taco bell oh yeah yeah things. look we wanted taco bell late last night yeah and is your taco bell not 24 hours no it is no oh, i just can... i was just you know cuddly and i didn't want to uh, leave. we should have went with here. her <laughs> no that's a good <laughs> no. adventure bro uh, sometimes you need an adventure she wasn't tripping right no yeah so you're good yeah yeah that's good man that's that's like the best just go to a random place it almost like you know when you're tripping like and you like change a room and it feels like you went to a whole new world. Yeah, oh, dude, 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 this was like my first time tripping at the house. Oh yeah, so, I didn't even think about that. Yeah, yeah. that was. That when was, was the really last awesome. time you tripped before that? Like whenever I came down to when yeah, you guys at the, the apartment. At the apartment. Yeah, man. Yeah. And I mean the yeah, apartment was cool. I like the yeah. trees outside of. Yeah, like, it was fire. Balcony. Yeah, I I kind of liked your balcony the best of it, all the things yeah. though. You know what I mean? Yeah. Did we watch Stranger Things or something weird? I feel no, like you watched... put me on the Stranger Things. Then, really? I mean, yeah, I might have left it on. Yeah, like I feel for like, you and... or I, I think it was like, yeah, like I think it was towards the end of the trip, and like, yeah, you like you right. put it on, and I was like laying there watching it. I was like, this is fucking <laughs> weird. <laughs> then I was like, I kind of like Stranger Things. <laughs> yeah, so that's sort of weird. You don't usually like those types of. No, I'm not into like sci-fi shit. Yeah. Yeah, but I it was good, it. man. I do like Stranger Things. I, I'm really bad about watching TV shows anymore, though, because I kind of just lose interest really fast and shit. I run through so much. Like, yeah, TV. well, that's how I get. I either binge it hard. I, I can't, like, 
if I'm busy, like if I'm like working all the time, I can't like get into a show. Because I like yeah. to binge it. If I'm going to watch it, I like to just like crush like five episodes at a right. time or something. You know what I mean? And uh, I can't just be like, oh, I'll catch an episode here and then tomorrow I'll catch another episode. I just, it, I'll fucking lose it. Because then you miss a couple of days and you're just like, eh, fuck it. I don't need to watch it. <laughs> I think my, I think my memory is just fucked. You know what I mean? Like, I think I do too many things in a day that my memory is fucked. So then it's like, I'd rather watch five in a row because then you're in it. You know what I mean? Right. And you can remember what happened all the other episodes. And it's like, <laughs> Yeah, my memory. I just, I'm fucking too much, bro. I think brains are like hard drives, bro. Yeah. That's why you gotta smoke some weed and get, you know, you gotta yeah. uh, corrupt some of those. That yeah, files. Up in there. <laughs> yeah, corrupt <Yeah>. some files. <laughs> <laughs> fucking delete them shits. Right. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's, it's very, your brain's very much like a hard drive, actually. It's actually probably like the perfect analogy for a brain. Because it's almost yeah. like some things, because hard drives, they have to like scan for things. You know what I mean? So like, that's me especially and they scan so, slower when they're really full so like i so feel like things, mine's full so like daily things we uh i guess we forget like say we have a routine it's like already embedded so our brain like forgets like the routine of the day you know what i mean in a sense what do you mean like it, no, i don't know what you mean it gets rid of uh, the unnecessary information. It's like, oh, okay, I yeah, was already yeah, yeah. on this car ride, so like, I'm not right. going to remember every, every little person detail on the about side. that. Yeah, right. So it's weird how it works like that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You start you start getting less information, like retaining less information from that trip. That makes sense. And when I say Switch trip, up I mean your like routine. A, a car. Me, I I wish I could. <laughs> That's the bad thing about a nine to five job. You kind of right. have to work at nine to five <laughs> every fucking day. <laughs> That's the downfall of a of a regular job. But right. uh, it is what it is. You know what I mean. And we're against I do those switch around it. here. I fuck regular jobs. I uh, I do switch it up. I go to different fast food restaurants every time I eat. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> When I'm driving around, I don't always eat at McDonald's. I eat at you McDonald's. You gotta start packing a lunch, bro. I was for a while. It's just hard to because I don't have any way of heating shit up. So it's like, right. what am I gonna eat? A fucking you gotta get a thermos and put soup in it. I don't even like soup. I know soup's retarded. Stupid. It's resmarted. Yeah, it's um, it's uh, like I like cream soups, like a oh, see, like that's like a bisque. Worse. Or like a like a broccoli cheese soup or something from Panera. That shit's fire. But I don't really care for broth. Like, oh, give me some animal water. So I'm I I do like soups. Let me get some meat kidding. water. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the fucking meat. What the fuck? I mean, and I'll drink some water. Like, like it doesn't make sense I like to me. Fa, fa, fa. Yeah, it's fire. It's yeah, my favorite fa. restaurant's Fa Kim. Oh yeah, not really, but it's pretty good. They have good sushi. Okay, it's a. Yeah, have you been there? I think I have. It's on eighty eight. Yeah, it's called yeah. Fa Kim eighty eight. Yeah, yeah. It sounds like a joke, but it's really not. <laughs> I'm listening, I'm not joking. It's a real fucking place, but everyone calls it Fo. So like everyone's like, oh, Fo Kim. Yeah. You know, fucking Americans. Yeah. You know, the fucking Americans. Yeah, yeah, Fa Kim Americans. <laughs> Oh, that's so fucking dumb. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's talk about that, man. Uh, that's the Mandela effect right there. That's to me. That is the, uh, the Yahoo shit. The drink. Yeah. No, it's the drink is Yahoo, and it always has been. But I remember it as Yahoo. That's all I'm saying. And for some reason, Ali does too. Yeah, but, uh, I'm probably not the only one, guys. Comment. If you thought it was Yahoo, the drink, the chocolate drink. It's um, so good. It's not, though. It's really not even that good. I fucking love it. It's not that good. You ever have the stuff in the can? No, that sounds even, it's probably even worse. <laughs> there's no difference. There is a, you can't say there's no difference. There really isn't. Can you not tell the difference between a can of like Coke, 
versus a no no no. Coke? I can't tell the no no. There's I definitely can? a difference there. Can you? <laughs> I can. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, man. I feel like there's always a difference no, if you I, put it in a can. I did a taste test. I did a taste test. A Yahoo taste test. I don't believe you. <laughs> I did a Yahoo taste test. A Yahoo taste test. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, that shit's fucking stupid. It's definitely Yahoo, dude. But what gets me is you and Allie were On singing the, same page. the little... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> singing the little... <laughs> Yahoo! Yeah, and she couldn't even hear me, so it's not even like she was like, "Oh yeah, you're right." Like, you know what I mean? It's like, yeah, that's definitely what it is. It's a fact. No. It's very Mandela search engine, <laughs> search engine commercial. Like that. I think what's confusing about it is there was a commercial for a search engine. Yeah, I guess that's true. That's probably yeah. yeah why the fuck was there a commercial for a search engine? It's so stupid. Who even oh, used no. Yahoo? I guess I used Yahoo. I had a Yahoo email at one point. Yeah, I mean, because Google wasn't always. Yeah, well, Google wasn't tough. even a thing whenever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just yeah. saying, well, it might have been a thing, but like I'd never used it. I um, mean, Ask Jeeves was one of the first, right? Um, I remember, yeah, Ask Jeeves. I think Yahoo I mean, even, and Ask Jeeves were like the same time, though. Yeah. Even AOL, I, like, you could search on there, I think. Yeah, yeah. Well, that was a lot of them. There was, like, a lot of those browsers. Like, I think uh, MSN was one. Yeah. You could Bro, search. I lived off the little Yahoo, or the um, AOL free disk. And. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you would get, like, a month free. Right, But, right. like, we lived in the apartment complex. So we would just go around and steal everybody's fucking hell yeah this and shit so you just, just had free fucking internet <laughs> hell yeah it's probably why they stopped doing it thanks bro yeah but no yeah, yeah. probably no nah, i mean well also i think why were people mailing people things about fucking that's like the same thing as like commercials like like why why was anyone mailing you things about the internet like here you want the internet here here's a disc that's weird man it's such a weird time dude it was it was fun. Kids will never understand, dude. I know. My kids. Yeah, will I never used to get steal it. a lot of mail as a kid. Yeah, in those apartments. Yeah, probably shouldn't talk about that. I mean, it's kind like, of a federal offense, and I don't think there's a <laughs> I was a child, and it's <laughs> been it fucking matter. years. <laughs> I don't know. Just don't mention we used, any <laughs> like we used to just, find credit cards and shit. As your attorney, I advise you to stop <laughs> talking about this. <laughs> <laughs> It was so remember? easy to just lift the mailboxes, each individual mailbox. Right. And yeah, they're not apartments. Yeah, it's all apartment buildings. They're not very secure. Right. It's very easy to get into mailboxes. So sorry, guys, if you live in an apartment building and your mail gets stolen, it's just part of it. Get a P.O. box. You know what I mean? <laughs> get, a <PO> box. <laughs> get a fucking P.O. box. That's the craziest thing, man. Like, I've heard of people getting like... uh you know, sending like getting mail, like ordering like shady things, like yeah, barely legal things, and uh, right. just getting them sent to apartment buildings. So then they just pick them up because they just leave them there, right? Like Amazon yeah. people. I literally went to this apartment building to pick up a dog, um, or a cat. I don't know, whatever, a fucking pet, and um, meow. <laughs> and I uh, meow 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 meow, and I um, <laughs> there was literally like a stack. A fucking stack of Amazon packages, like you oh know, those little like white God. and blue envelopes. There were so yeah. many, bro. There had to at least be fucking thirty or forty of them, bro. Yeah, just stacked I was up. Watching, I was like, I was what watching the fuck, a, man? A prof video. Do you ever listen to prof? Mm, no, I don't think so. He had a video. I know you're watching like though because it's been recommended. I'm like, why is this recommended me? Like, I don't even know who the fuck <laughs> this is. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, his intro is him doing a unboxing video and it, he's like this package used to belong to such and such we're gonna see what she got <laughs> that's so funny <laughs> it's just him lifting packages and doing unboxing this is such a smart idea <laughs> it's like, so funny yeah until it, it's probably faked i would i would hope that it's fake you know what it's I mean? definitely fake yeah yeah i would hope no it's like it's the intro fun. to a music video well okay we're, we're... That's funny. He's though. fucking dope, man. Yeah, that shit is kind of funny. Today, though. that was dope. 
I'll have to check him out. He keeps getting recommended to me. I don't know how. <laughs> Look, my dad put me on to him. Really? Yeah. I, I had my dad share me his uh, Spotify playlist. Like his playlist? Yeah. Yeah, like his most listened to of 2020. Yeah. He listens to a lot of good music. Can't you just add people on Spotify? Kind of like social media? Can't you like follow individual people? Think so? And you can like see what they're listening to at like as because I know like as, at so that time yeah, like yeah if yeah they're on say, at the same time right yeah I would say I know I see it whenever I pull up like the the web browser version um like the web like the computer PC app um right when I open that I uh I'll see because I sign in through my Facebook so I'll see like all like whatever Facebook friends that are listening they'll tell me what they're listening to it's kind of weird and cool at the same time I guess. I have clicked yeah. on people's music. I was like, what the fuck are they listening to? And I'll click on it and be like, oh, okay. Yeah. I mean, sometimes it's my thing sometimes is, man, I, like, I, I always look at what people are listening to and it's like just always outdated. Yeah. yeah it'll and be like, like, and like to me, outdated is like last year. You know or it'll I mean? be like all eyes on me. <laughs> <laughs> like, but, but see, I, I can respect that. Yeah. Cause like, it's like that's a classic, a, you know, it's like, right. A classic. But like, if you're listening to like, Yo Gotti from, from yeah, or like uh, I was trying to think of a popular Drake song, but I can't. Yeah, like an right, old, like old, yeah, older Drake songs. <laughs> right, 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 right. Yeah, I'm not into it. I'm not even a Drake fan, to be honest. I'm not. Never I mean, I've li- I'll, I'll, there's like a couple songs that I think I I have like in a playlist somewhere that I'll play occasionally, but yeah, I mean, I think Forty is a good producer. I, I yeah. Better. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not into. It's so fabricated, for real. Yeah, no, I don't like. I it. mean, I don't know. I'll say, I do agree with people when people say like Drake's one of the top artists right now. Though. Like he's like legitimately. I'll, yeah, I would yeah, even. It's a whole machine behind him. Like, right, that's, that's what I'm saying. But like, yeah. he's at he's at like a, a crazy level of uh, stardom. You know what I mean? Right. But I also say I I think the same thing. I would take Kendrick though over Drake. It's just Kendrick doesn't. Yeah, I like Kendrick's style. Um, I like it's it's a lot more creative than like most things you that come out. You know what I mean? Like he kind of yeah. it doesn't feel as like cookie cutter. You know what I mean? Right. Like, like someone just like okay, this is the formula of how you make a hit. You know what I mean? Like he doesn't. He kind of goes against the grain with that. So I kind of fuck with Kendrick a little more. But uh, he also doesn't put out projects constantly either. You know what I mean? Right. He's very like he'll go like three years without a project. You know what I mean? Who Drake's the very future? Who is it? Poo Shiesty. Poo Shiesty. You heard it here, folks. Poo Shiesty. <laughs> I mean, he's he's had a a few hits already. Word. I don't like, know if I know any of his songs. I think, I know I think it's here. very, very uh, early in his career. Yeah. Right now. Yeah. How old is he? Do you know? I don't know. I don't know. Weird. I'm all about ages for some reason. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I just I just find it interesting the the age of people. I don't yeah. I don't like put them in a box based on their age, but I like it's interesting to see um even age like people their that success. Are, <laughs> well no, not even that. It's just like I just like to see um you can tell like the difference between like a, a fucking 18 year old artist and a 25 year old artist you know what i mean like you could tell by what they what they talk about you know what i mean like it's almost uh i just i don't know i just just find it interesting it's you know bro interesting i'm interested in interesting things yeah what else do you find interesting Mm. um how much man Uh, um i don't know what else i find interesting what do you find interesting? <laughs> uh, nerdy shit. I don't know. Space. 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 I wish is, I could. I don't really I care I enough. Little... I don't care enough about space to be honest with you. Look, I, I, I thought the other day I was like, I have never seen a picture of space from space, and I, I like just spent like an hour just looking at pictures. From it's like because the um of like stars. It's because of uh the government faked us going to space, bro. We've never been to space. Yeah. That's why you can't find a picture 
<laughs> of space <laughs> from space because nobody's ever been able to be up there to take that picture. We gotcha. just have a picture of our round earth you know what i mean right. <laughs> that's the only pictures we uh, ever see <laughs> i mean it could be flat and still round right facts <laughs> <laughs> that is true <laughs> yeah it could just be i mean but it's always three-dimensional right it's a it could be a but it, i guess the arguments is it a disc or is it a sphere right i don't know i think well wasn't it a part of it that it's like we're floating on a turtle like it's a turtle shell yeah <laughs> i've seen that before <laughs> how else would you explain us like what do you think this is what? bro? <laughs> how, you didn't know you didn't know turtles flew <laughs> and they have their babies on their back bro that's why there's turtles yeah. in the ocean <laughs> oh my God. just saying bro that's how uh that's how turtles live bro but yeah yeah, it's a it's a strange one, man. The ice walls are the funniest, though. It's so funny when people just say there's ice walls surrounding the. I mean, hey, I ain't never been out of the United States, so. Neither have I. So, <laughs> but there's definitely people. I'm telling you, I, you I don't have... think other countries exist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not real. <laughs> I don't even think Mexico is real. <laughs> I don't see it from here. <laughs> Oh, that's funny man yeah i don't think anything's real the ocean's not even <laughs> real right now i can't see that shit can you look out your window and see the ocean fake no <laughs> fake, fake news it's not a real thing yeah i do want to get a drone and fly it over my house over your house i thought you were gonna say over yeah. the ocean well no over to the ocean possibly. i want to find a drone how long of a distance what's like the a drone with like the longest distance that you can control it from the you know what I mean? Like, could I fly a drone across the United States? I mean, not a like consumer right. grade drone. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I need a drone, and I think even like military drones, they have like they have a to range. Refuel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would assume the battery would probably die. I mean, how far could you? I mean, those batteries on like the consumer grade ones only last what like an hour, two hours maybe. Oh, so. Do they have batteries in the military grade? I would assume. You know, we could have somebody on here and talk to them about that shit. Yeah, I would assume they have batteries. They probably have... I would I would believe that the military has way better batteries than are available to us, though. Yeah. Yeah, I think they hold technology. Yeah, they definitely do. Yeah, you know I mean? And, and I feel like that would, be, that, te- that would be a worthwhile You'll always talk. see that technology in movies before it's ever... Yeah actually public right so you can always look to movies to see what's coming next yeah because they they got that insider information i guess facts facts yeah i just think uh yeah i I do i feel like they have better better batteries man yeah like i feel like almost maybe well i guess it would still make it a better battery but i feel like they have faster charging batteries as well yeah like, you know how, like, Probably. your phone, like, now you get, like, the newest iPhone or whatever, it charges in, like, an hour, like, full, from zero to a hundred in an hour or whatever. Really? Yeah, I think it's, it takes I forever. think it's about, I think it's about that fast. Yeah. But, um, it's pretty fucking quick. With their charger, like, obviously, you have to use their plug, you can't buy, like, some third-party plug or whatever. But, um, yeah, so, like, it, it wouldn't surprise me if there's, like, a phone out there that charges in, like, fucking 30 seconds that they use in right. the fucking military. You know what I mean? Because what are you going to do? Like, if you're out doing whatever, you know what I mean? Like, and you're fucking stuck somewhere. We could always phone's ask dead. somebody. That's the yeah, thing. man. But do you know anyone? You want to talk to Kevin? I, mean, I don't know. Crumb might know. Crumb might know. It's good. Yeah. yeah. Crumb, Crumb, Crumb would be the person to talk to about all that yeah, shit. Yeah, we could talk to Crumb about that. That'd be dope. Yeah. I'll, I'll hit him up this week. So. Yeah. We'll have, to, we'll have to figure that out. Yeah. Because that would be interesting. I would like to know about what he knows about the military. Yeah. Let's let's expose the military. <laughs> let's <laughs> expose. I mean, he definitely got a... I mean, he, it's coming out in his music. Yeah. One way or another. Yeah, yeah. Right. I mean, I've heard some of the music he has now. And yeah, that's why I said I, I think it would be dope to talk to him and, like, you know what I mean? Like, really just, like, sit down and, like... 
instead of getting like snippets and music, just get like the get right. the full picture. Right, right. Curious. Interested. Curious George. Mm-hmm. We're coming up with a pretty cool list of people that uh we can get on here though. Yeah, I got two. <laughs> out of that whole thing. <laughs> Well, who was who were some? We got two people: Crum and who, Ian. And Ian, and then, um, there was another person. I don't know. Maybe there wasn't. Yeah, there was some random dude. I can't remember his name. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. There you go. I mean, <laughs> Miles. Yeah, Miles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Miles. Yeah, we already got him. Um, I just want to write him down because I'll forget him. Right. But um, yeah, man. Who else could we get on here? That would be uh interesting. <laughs> That would tell us some weird things about things. I don't know. I've I've been seeing people uh, pay um, celebrities on Cameo and trick them into saying stuff. That'd That's be kind hilarious. Of, kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, I kind of want to go on Cameo and like uh, start like a whole a whole thing of um. Or what's the new thing? There's a new one out where you can ask a celebrity a question or some. Your shit. camera quality just went to shit all of a sudden. I mean, you're good now. It, yeah. it does look a little pixely. A little bit. If that was any more pixelated, it'd be a radio, bro. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's a group of men, bro. It's a Facebook group of men. <laughs> I think it's called like if that had any le- if that had less pixels, it would be radio. Hmm. Yes. You are in some interesting groups. I am, I am, I am in some weird groups. Maybe I should just like make a post in all the weird groups and say, hey, are you interesting? Do right. you want to be on a podcast? Yeah. Hit me up. <laughs> it would work. I still want to talk you to a like fucking... You like crusty feet? <laughs> I still want to talk to a, like an OnlyFans chick. Yeah. Like someone making money on OnlyFans, not just like a random right. person. Because anyone right. can have an OnlyFans account. Like I want to yeah. talk to someone that's balling, not balling. Even if they're only like if they're just making enough to pay their bills on OnlyFans, like I, they don't have to be fucking rich, getting right. rich off of it. But if they're making yeah. like a, a couple grand a month, you know what I mean? Yeah, I want to talk to you because I'm curious about the industry. <laughs> You're trying to get in, bro. <laughs> yeah, I need parts. Oh, I thought, so I thought I had this idea, something, feel free someone to steal it because I never execute any of my ideas. Anytime you hear an idea oh, on this uh, podcast, guys, feel free to uh, steal it because I probably will never nah, do it. Don't steal my ideas, fuckers. I mean, well, from me, if I say it. Yeah, yeah, steal I'll sue the fuck out of you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I, uh, so I had an idea, it's like, so can you make different on OnlyFans? So if I made an OnlyFans right now, right, could I have right. like multiple to pull people on the same OnlyFans. Like, could I just use it as like I distribute content? So you like, can could be, I be a like promoter. a You can promote other other pages. But do I kind of make money off of it? I wanted to be yeah, like pe- an OnlyFans. People will pay you to promote their pages. I wanted to be like an OnlyFans pimp. Yeah, you can do that, but I I have a feeling it works better if you're already an OnlyFans chick. Yeah, I just want to be a I mean? pimp. You could, I mean, you might be able like to do it's it a with new dudes, way to dude. Pimp. I just dude. feel like it's a new way to pimp. That's all, dude. We could do it. You can do it with dudes, dude. Dude, <laughs> I could. I don't yeah. know. I don't know that many dudes. Well, that's that's what you would have to do. You would have to reach out on a uh, like Reddit. Yeah, but then I'd have to have it, a following. So here's my plan, right? Let me break it down. Let me, and let that's, me explain that's the where logistics. I'm getting at. You would probably have to post some pictures and some videos. Right. And get a following and then yeah, start. Yeah, that's like a, such a long process, I feel like. So well, Look, for man. me, it's not a long process at all. But <laughs> <laughs> It's pretty short. <laughs> yeah, it's a short process. <laughs> Looks like an acorn. <laughs> <laughs> acorn hiding in a fucking grass but, um, that's what i don't shave but <laughs> <laughs> but no i um no but yeah i just think it would be cool to like i wouldn't even promote them like i would just i would make the only fans right i would have the account and i would just have multiple girls or guys 
either one or guys or guys yeah. <laughs> or guys <laughs> that um <laughs> that want to put out nudes but they don't want to go through the whole thing of like managing the page i'd essentially yeah. be their page manager but i would have them all <laughs> on one thing you know what i'm saying okay they would all be on one thing and then people could ask for whoever you know what i mean yeah and I uh it. and i slang i slang the pictures <laughs> you know why don't you just get some fake, get some pictures off like the internet, and like start posting them like that? Because sometimes people want to pay and have conver- they want to have like conversations with people and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Like I said, I just want to manage someone's account, yeah, or multiple people's accounts. I just want to okay. be a pimp, bro. That's my lifelong dream. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like that's the most legal pimping you could ever do in your life. Yeah, you know what I mean, right? I feel like that's the move, man. No, I feel you. I'm I'd be the internet pimp. <laughs> Only one. I'm sure there's probably plenty out there. Yeah. But yeah, I don't know. I just think it'd be a cool uh a cool way to be a part of OnlyFans without being a part of OnlyFans. Yeah. And making some extra money. I could do it. Real, gonna, I could do it like a, the, you're gonna have to post a dick pic. <laughs> I don't think there's any way around it. What do you mean? I could just, just think, I just think get you'll content look. from other people. Yeah. Now I wonder. So can you and let's so, say uh, reverse I've never, search it? Have you ever? Um, have you ever been on OnlyFans? Like, have you not like made content, but like, have you ever been a, a purchaser? Consumer? Yeah, purchase, like a consumer, like purchase cons. No. Yeah. yeah, yeah. See, I always wondered. I, I was curious about um how exactly it worked. Like, I yeah. know you can request certain things, but like, yeah, I guess you set your own prices, right? Right. So couldn't I just go find a chick that's cheaper and then up purchase her product and then put it on my own <laughs> OnlyFans oh, and just charge a little more money? I do think they put disclaimer. It, it, you would have to find someone who doesn't have one of those disclaimers in their uh, bio. Yeah. Yeah. That could be how but we started pe- off. I think people were catching on to that. Yeah. I'm sure there's a, I'm sure that's not the first time that anyone's ever thought of that. Cause I don't know if you can screenshot or not in there. Do you think it would send them a message? It might kind of like how like Snapchat works and whatnot. Right. Where like, if you take a picture or save a picture or whatever, like they know. Yeah. Hmm. It's interesting. There's got to be a way to do it. You could probably. I wonder. I wonder. Oh, if, look, that used they, to be a workaround have, on Snapchat. They have a special on Hulu about OnlyFans. Check do it they? out. I will check it out. Actually, I have no, seen it. There used to be a what's it called? Um, there used to be like a workaround on Snapchat where you know how you can like screen record. Yeah. And like people, that's what people would do. They would just screen record, and then you can screenshot off of your. Yeah. Screen recording. That's so, that's so weird. <laughs> I'm just saying that was like the workaround. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? With Snapchat, it makes a little more sense because, you know, Snapchat goes away after you open it. Right. So, you know what I mean? If you yeah. want to check it out later. But I think OnlyFans, it probably stays in your messages or however that, however it's distributed to you. I mean, if you purchased it, I'm sure you can look at it as long as you fucking would like. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. It's still strange. It's, it's a strange business, man. Yeah, I have seen I mean, some interviews with chicks that, I mean, I don't know how big of a channel they have, but they said some guys like just like to, uh, some guys are just like, they just want to have conversation with them and shit. Right. Like they just pay yeah. to have conversation. I mean, it makes me so sad. That's, isn't that what escorts are? Technically, yeah. quote yeah. unquote. Just there yeah. for conversation and for you to take yeah. out. And It's a, uh, yeah, it's a very lonely, uh, lonely way to live your life, I guess. But, hey man, teach your own. Know. Yeah. I would never pay for an escort. No. I'd pay for a prostitute, but I wouldn't pay for an escort. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what I mean? Like, why am I going to pay for you to go to dinner that I have to pay for? You know what I mean? Like, look, 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 no, that's so just the job description, bro. She comes back to the hotel. <laughs> 100%. I understand. Unless that, you're fucking a weirdo and some, I think. Yeah, no, for sure. I think that's but, just their way out. <laughs> no, one hundred percent, and it's illegal. They can't like list themselves as right. a prostitute. But um, but yeah, it's, I don't know. It's just one of those things. Like I don't, 
I don't get the, I just want to have a conversation. Yeah. You know what I mean? Some people are lonely, man. Go to a bar. Yeah. I mean, I don't think it's that easy. That's too much work for some people, dude. Yeah. It could just be like yeah. a social, yeah, like social awkwardness. Yeah. yeah. I wish some they would just legalize prostitution. Easy. You know what I mean? Bro, it is legal in places. Like, it should be legal everywhere. It's the oldest occupation. Yeah. That's what they say, at least. Yeah. That might be propaganda. Yeah, yeah, doesn't it? I, f- I feel like maybe like a rice farmer or something. Really? That's like second <laughs> longest? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a... Uh, no, nah, it's just a strange thing that... uh, Like in Pennsylvania, obviously prostitution is not legal, but I can, I can go to a masseuse, get completely naked, and have them touch the entirety of my body except for my penis yeah as soon as they touch my penis it's illegal it's so weird it's such a weird fucking rule dude like you know what i mean like it turns illegal yeah, as soon as they hold up were you there when we were checking out spaces for uh oh yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah and there was that bed that mattress that chick and the dude or whatever that shit's funny dude yeah man but yeah that's definitely a whorehouse for sure Oh, we probably could have got a good fucking deal on that place, though, for real. Probably. Yeah. yeah, if you were still up here, I'd probably look back into it if it's still open. It'd be a good <laughs> studio, like a, a podcast studio type spot, you know what right. I mean? Right. Yeah, I mean, they had the studio right next door. Right. Yeah. Yeah, that shit's uh. Then we could have interesting prostitutes to talk to, you know what I mean? Like, we have prostitutes. Right. Ass, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's like the Howard Stern show set up right there, you know what I mean? I swear. <laughs> uh, that was money. <laughs> missed opportunity there right (laughs) yeah man that shit's uh but yeah man i don't know i just think prostitution should be legal i think everything should be legal though that's like my stance on everything yeah Yeah. like drugs whatever like as long as you're not hurting somebody like as long as your choice isn't affecting the health and well-being of somebody else yeah fuck it fuck it yeah i mean i'm I'm kind of prostitution is probably the weirdest one though to be honest yeah. Because like I said, you can, it's not illegal if I go and just meet a girl and we both consensually want to have sex. But as soon as I hand her money to have sex with me and she's agreeing <laughs> consensually, like, you know what I mean? She's giving me consent. Like, it's fucking illegal. As soon as there's money exchanged, what if, what so it's like you, you can do her, it for free. Yeah. What if you give her like a diamond necklace? Yeah. Or like take her out to dinner. Or, yeah. uh, yeah. I'm more of a pearl necklace type of guy, but you know, bro. What if you just give her Bitcoin? Um, that might be illegal still. You, you're just gifting Bitcoin, right? Bitcoin well, I mean, you could, you could, so you could just, gift. you could also say that you're just gifting them money. You could be like, oh, I didn't give them the money for sex. I just gave them money yeah. because I wanted to give them money or something like. You know what I mean? Right. You could they say that, but like, <laughs> right? Yeah, it's a. Uh, it's just, I don't know, it's such a weird fucking thing. I feel like if I got arrested for uh, prostitution, I could definitely get an attorney to get me out of it. I'm sure it happens a lot. I'm sure that exact scenario happens. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, yeah man, I don't know. I just think uh, prostitution should be legal, period. Yeah. Let's end the episode on that. Prostitution should be <laughs> legal. Thank you guys for watching the Bad Posture Podcast. If you guys have any ideas of unique things, out of the box ideas, weird shit you would like to see on this, um, and we like your idea, we'll do it. Only if we like it. Because we kind of We're fucking whores out here. Yeah. But at the same time, like we said at the beginning, like you said at the beginning, don't want to force us into anything. We're not going to do it just because you said we want to do it. If we want to do it, we'll do it. So leave your suggestions.